What is up, everybody? Bryce and Sprinter here. Coming to you with Monitor, the game, day two. So, last time we left out, we were kind of just following everyone around, trying to figure out what was going on exactly in this big manner that they're in. Um, apparently, someone's working on a viral cure for... Um, muscular sclerosis and it lays dormant for a while three days I believe and then it uh, activates so what I'm thinking is it's gonna be a bad bad day for everyone in there now at the beginning we were told that once the guests leave we're going to be compensated my thinking is the guests are not going to leave. I think there's going to be a very horrific event happen. But, we'll see. Let's load it up. Going into day number two. Day two. Monitor the game. Here's the famous maze. Down. Oh. Oh. No. Recap of day one. Hey, sweet Hello, recap. Amelia. Long time no see. Nice. It's always good to see an employee such as yourself take up my invitation. See? There's free food and drink. How could I pass that up? Who could pass that up, really? <laughs> Is that all I'm good for? I'm sorry for the rough transit from your home to this place, but I'm giving you the opportunity of your life. What are you that saying? That was Mr. X. I found a man who could cure multiple sclerosis. We've been having troubles with the monitor systems you've been using, so they may short circuit a little bit. We've managed to figure out a way how to fix it, but you can only do it once a day. I, I didn't even do it. I'm a researcher for Mr. Bell. I Probably should have, huh? For MS. Say what? Say yes, what? And I believe I found it. I'm working on something called Oh yeah, chrysalis, that's right. A drug which restores the nervous system. How long have you been suffering? This is going to be a I bad day. I think it started a year ago. He just took this uh, medication too, by the way. He's on day three, I want to say. I think it's on day three. Alright. Let's continue. I don't like the maze anymore. Oh, see? See? Bad news. Dallas. That's the company. I'm scared for these people. Good night, what a long loading screen. Alright, so the porch. Oh, do you wish to repair the monitor? Oh no, I can't repair that. Uh, from the very beginning? Alright, we're gonna fix it. Hmm. It seemed a crazy night yesterday. Did you manage to clean up after us? Room. Oh, you know, we clean up quick. Indeed. We all have a lot of work to do, and not enough time to do it. Isn't that Thank the you for case, my coffee. always? No problem, Albert. So this is Albert and the waitress. Okay, so we were introduced to the waitress. <clears throat> okay. So I wonder if this means there's people in I here. Shared some embarrassing things with you, I believe it does. But... I guess you can't remember. Thank God. Wait. Yes, you were telling me that you'd suffered with something like that before. Yes, and that's that's between us, okay? So <laughs> well, wait a minute. Now, right? Uh oh. Yes. Well, an abundant amount of showering and cleaning products has fixed that. I'll keep that in mind. <laughs> What? <laughs> I've missed it. No, 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 no. Oh. You were a lot of fun. 
So are you. Hmm. It's nice to see someone with so much life for a change. In my line of work, it's interesting. Something you don't see much. Well, I won't change if you don't. Deal. There's something that I need to figure out with these two. There's something interesting going on there. No! Oh, okay. I thought my monitor broke. Ah. So, wait a minute. So, I thought these waves here meant that there were people talking. Maybe you, not. You used to be so, Maybe so though. horrible to me. Lag. Eat a whole egg in the shell. Seriously. Yeah, here. Eat the raw egg in the shell? <laughs> no, Maybe no I thanks. should have said to crack it open first. I guess. Ugh, asshole. Language. Craziness. The study. Yeah, there's still people going. If send out talking. any works, you would be helping millions of lives. As my business partner, it would only seem fitting. Who is his business, business partner? Partners. Oh, okay. Not yet. Ah, John and Emilio are striking up a deal. I can sell half of my majority share in the company to you just before it even happens. Oh, that sounds Won't shady. That look remarkably mm -hmm. shady. Perhaps. See. Who See? Cares when we have the potential cure for a lifetime. You're asking me to do something incredibly illegal here on a gamble that may not work. Don't do it. Very true. Do not do but it. I thought it was about time I honored my longest friend by giving them a treat. It's always a bad idea. Very well. It's a deal. Very no! Good. I'll see what I can do. Not smart. Not smart. See? Greed, man. Greed. Well, Get you every time. You know you can talk to me, Katie. These two have been hanging out quite Thanks, a bit. Then. Lana and Katie. So why have you not talked to anyone else in your family for a while? I don't know I... about it. Uh, had an addiction. To what? Cocaine. Drugs. Oh, Lana, I... I'm clean Event now. Board. I have been for six months. Why? I mean, I six mean, months is six months. Why That's good. Why did you start? <laughs> I just... You know, I was weak. Got bored. That's all. I doubt that. What was wrong? Hmm. I just... Uh-oh. <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Don't cry. <laughs> I wish I could distinguish who was who. My mom died almost uh, over a year ago, and Emilio became my guardian, and he was never there. She used to abuse me. She called me stupid. A whore. A bitch. No abuse is ever my dad okay. Had left years Verbal. Ago. Or physical. I never knew where he went. Or emotional. He could rot. Never. However, John stepped in and he always had time for me. John? He John. would always be there if I could. That's the uncle the that's not really the uncle, right? If I could get to the phone because of my mom. But there was Emilio. And I couldn't bear it. He never did a thing for me. I took his money and I ran. All right. I ended up in some and we've of the spent three hours places, watching this thing so in the far. arms of the strangest men and women in the worst situations. I decided to get clean the best I could after ending up in an alleyway. Good girl. That's that's half awesome. Naked with no money and a broken arm. That's not cool. Then all of a sudden, I get a phone call from him, asking for me to come back to make amends for how he treated me. So here I am, alone. There's something shady going on here. Lana. I'm sorry. I shouldn't have. 
Reminds me of a movie. Mm. Mm. I won't tell you what movie. Lana, I, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I just... I have to go. Lana! Fuck! Language? Goodness, goodness. They didn't even finish their uh, game of billiards. Hey, what's wrong? Hey. Are you having a, oh. a weird day, too? Sorry. It was Probably. Lana. You? Sorry, Lana. Oh, yeah. Sorry, sorry. Yeah, confusing one. Want to talk about it? I'm not, not really. sure it'd be something I could explain, but... I just got... Got what? No, uh, never mind. What about you? Ah, your uncle's being a dick, but that's not unusual. So I got to do some work on my day off. <laughs> ah, figures. Doesn't it always... What's wrong, girl? Always what happens. What do you know about Katie? Has she done something to you? Ah, uh, she's conniving. Oh, no, no. What do you know about her? Yeah, she has some history with Emilio, but they never let on what it was. I've had a few altercations with her purely for her being so secretive and leading Emilio on. If I was honest, I think she bats for the other side. Why? No reason. Hmm. Was just interesting. That's interesting. Well, you'll find me if you need me. I gotta make some phone calls. Thanks, Uncle John. Ooh, I need to follow John. Is she going to say anything else? Okay. Need to find John. Ah, oh, hello, Lana. Well, hello, hmm. Albert. <laughs> You've been Albert. keeping yourself oh. quiet. I could say the same of you. Well, no, she has I started not. drinking already. Seemed a better hangover cure than what the chef had. Raw I get the sense you're trying to forget <laughs> this weekend, Miss Remley. <laughs> yeah, well. So I wonder if there's three days because Hello, it's a Lana. weekend getaway. Albert. Could ah, be interesting. Mr. Dreyfus, delightful to see you again. I cannot read what yeah, is up here on the detected. How are you? Good. I see that you two probably want to have a bit of time together, so I'll be on my way. No, no. Oh, Don't. no, Albert. See. I was just leaving. Ooh, okay. Oh, I guess we can have some conversation. Let's see. Not the to sound rude. Lot thickens. I'm going to have a drink on my own. Well, oh, that is uh, very quite well, rude. Katie. She's a brat. Isn't there someone else in here, though? No, it was just Katie. So now it's just uh, John. Or Albert, I, I mean. I just wanted to help. I'll go. I promise not to bother you. No, don't go. I should have just... Katie and Lana again. I just... I kind of liked it. Liked what? You did? <laughs> hmm. So, what am I to do with this information, Miss Remley? We've I missed the information. We could explore it further. You are a researcher, after all, Miss Dreyfus. That so works for me. I have no idea what we've missed. This is terrible. And then they just quit talking. Uh, the study or the billiard room? Uh, let's go to the billiard room. There's always something juicy going on in here. Best. All right, I will. We always miss the conversations. 
I thought he might have been. Okay, bye. <laughs> no. Why? Why? Always. Okay, bye. Hey, have you seen Lana? She seemed a bit upset earlier. Not since this morning. So I Never wonder mind. if at 8 o'clock there's going to be dinner as what? well tonight. Should I be worried? No, George. George. Please don't get me involved unless it's absolutely necessary. The chef's name okay. is George. Now we just need to know who the waitress is. All right, so since there's no talking on the monitors, let's check out the event log here. Sounds like, uh-oh, sounds like Kitty, Kitty, Lana and Katie kissed, and that has confused Lana quite a bit. Hmm, Lana ate a raw egg in the shell. Yuck. Ah, uh, okay. So... We haven't really found a whole lot today. Uh, Lana was a, had an addiction to drugs. We did we did discover that. Oh oh oh! Dying I room. think you know full well. Who is this? <laughs> so sorry, Miss Literal. <laughs> Katie and Lana. Oh, for the first time, I feel dirty. <laughs> well, that goes without saying. I just feel happy. Cover your ears. I know. I feel the same. Can I be honest? Yeah. I didn't expect to find you. I came here to ruin Emilio. I didn't come here to listen to his Aww. excuses or his apologies. We're going to find All love. All I feel is Aww. rage. Heart. I don't think he's ever done anything out of spite, but... Whenever he's attempted to get his goals, he's never thought about the consequences. That's how a lot of driven I people really that, are. Uh, they kind of get this, you know. say, tunnel vision. You do? How? <laughs> and that's all One they day, see. My love. Like, all of this One around day. is just completely gone. It's nothing just but a tunnel. It's terrible. Let me enjoy this moment with you. Please? Before it breaks? Okay, but oh. you promise not to keep any secrets? No secrets. Hmm, interesting. What, are they still talking? Um, I'm going to the kitchen to get Guess something so. to eat. Stay here, okay? Hmm? <laughs> okay. Okay. To the kitchen. You idiot. I was hungover. Hey, hey. Still no excuse. Anyway. And the, got George and the waitress. I'm starving. Got to do the waitress. I'll make you a sandwich. Come on. Got to find out who the waitress is. Is that it? Ay, ay, ay. I know you and I don't get on very well. John, John I guess Kate. not. Oh, John is hurt. I was talking with Lana. Oh? She said you looked after her. This is yeah. the Uncle John. Yeah, I did. I, I believe. Uh, the I uncle that's not really an uncle? I think you had it in you to be nice. You'd be amazed, Katie. Maybe Emilio Listen, was the uncle that was I know really you the suspected uncle. that I'm I did lost. something to Giovanni. And he was your best friend, but, but please believe me, I am not your enemy. So did you do something? Your silence speak volumes. John, I want us to be able to get on. For Lana. Lana? Mm -hmm. What is she? Wait. I've grown very fond of her. Well, she did ask about you earlier. Aww. Okay, I'll try my best, but one day you need to open up to me, Katie. I promise. I will. I just... I can't at the moment. I can't do it alone. 
But I just hope that when I can tell you, that we can do it as friends. Okay. So what'd the floor say to you, anyway? What Shut are up. What talking about? <laughs> what'd the floor say okay. to you? Okay, you're ah. fine now. Just don't have any more fights. Thanks. Apparently he got knocked out. Okay. Oh! Oh, no, 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 My monitor's messed up. No! No remaining power. Rudd! Why did you punch John? Who punched him? Who punched him? He was asking too many questions. Albert? So, what, you thought that resorting to violence was the best solution? I ask again, who exactly are you? Did... is Albert the one... Questionable things. Albert's the Just one that took the medicine. Like you. Tell me, Katie. So... How did uh -oh. you feel putting that pillow over Giovanni Bell's face once you knew you couldn't save him all what? those years ago? What? How, how do you know? Oh. I've been hiding in the shadows, like yourself. I know of your research into cancer, and I know of the things you have done. So now the plot oh, is really people never really have a voice, vacant. do they? If you do anything to hurt any of them, I will come after you. Oh, you are full of empty threats. I will tell John and Emilio what you've done if you even attempt to let them know of who I am. And I will certainly Holy have fun with that little cow. Pussy. I fucking swear. Go. Wow. Stop. <sighs> Jeez. Crazy language. Do not cuss. Does not make you look cool. Considering the high emotion right now, I think Lana has done it. What? Ah, uh, it's too late to get this sorted now. I'll have to Emilio read them again and the first waitress. thing in the morning. Okay, Miss Bell. Hmm. Caught the last of that conversation. What's wrong? As always. We could be in danger, and I need you to be safe, alright? Alright. Oh, I need a drink. Is that it? Has all this happened? <sighs> Why must we always catch the end of these conversations? Hello? Yeah, it's me. I need to use that favor of yours. I need you to look up an Albert Greaves. Uh -oh. Can you find him? You found him? Okay. What's it say? He was a researcher at Athena Pharmaceuticals in what? Cancer prevention? Deceased? Mm. Are you sure? When did he die? Two years ago of cancer? So, uh oh. Who the fuck is here at the retreat? That is a good Can question. Can you dig into an Albert Greaves at Dolos Pharmaceuticals? Oh. Okay, I'll hang on. Not good. That is definitely. Talent detail. Emilio, you can't be implying that she's making this up. Oh, she was there when she died of the break-in. That doesn't mean she's making up a rape allegation. Get a grip, Emilio. I swear, you tell her what you said about my sister, I, or I will do something worse. Calm down, Emilio. The heck? Who is he right? talking to? She, Katie, maybe? She, she came into the room asking if I was all right, if I was lonely, what my dad used to do for her, and she, she, Emilio, stop this. She's told uh -oh. us enough. Oh, talk about telling the truth, Katie. Go on. Tell her what happened with Giovanni. Go on. 
How does everybody no. know? No, that's not fair. What happened with Giovanni? Katie? Or is this Albert? Do it! What? Your Uncle Gio came to my hospital at St. Fabian while I was a doctor and a nurse in some capacity there. He had collapsed at a fundraiser nearby and he was brought onto my ward. The MS had ravaged him. I told Emilio that he wasn't going to his private hospital, as he would die in transit. He bullied and threatened me, like he's doing now. Shut up. Tell her what you did. No. We both have blood on our hands, Emilio. You oh, told me to do it. Crap. <laughs> I know what happened. You didn't. I Guilty. euthanized your Uncle Giovanni because Emilio told me to. He threatened Wait a minute, what happened with the, the pillow there? And destroy it if I didn't... Why didn't you say no? I did. But Giovanni was so ill. His tumors were so bad that he couldn't sleep or eat, and I... I... See? You want to take something from me, Alana. You need to know the facts. I These are not nice people. She can not Look at all. You're both as bad as each other. Well, Lana, please, don't. That's any relationship that Lana and Katie had. Gone. Out the window. You bastard. Mm -mm. Oh. I heard that. Pretty sure that was a slap. Right across the old face of Rue. Holy moly. Wasn't I just here? I think so. Yeah, that should be it. There should be people in the dining room now. Apparently this is day two. Is that it? That's it for day two? Yeah. I believe it is. <clears throat> okay. So... We found out a few things. We missed a lot, though. Um, if we're going to solve this, we're definitely going to need to really get into the conversations in the, in the rooms. Um, but anyway, day two complete. Uh, I have no idea where this is going. We've, we've learned quite a bit about a lot of the characters in the game so far. I'm still kind of on the fence with the game. Uh, not something I always play, but I'm, I'm kind of digging the storyline. Um, in any case, if you liked the video, give it a thumbs up. Um, if you continue, want to continue wanting to see this type of game, leave a comment down below. Uh, if you want to see more of my games, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And as always, thanks every single one of you guys. I appreciate every single one of you all. And until next time, this is Crisis. I'm out.